hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to basically build out a fully fleshed canvas visivic editor pdf editor inside your browser so using js pdf pdf js and html2 canvas library so guys i have developed this application you will see it's a very awesome little editor where you can edit your pdf documents we have a functionality so that we can even add images here you will see you can add images you can resize these image like this and you can align your images in any direction so we also have you can center your images you can move right move left all that stuff you can do right alignment purposes you can even change the alignment here and you can even add excel documents as well guys you can see excel sheet so how many you can just select here 4 by 4 4 by 5 so here you can basically select here let's suppose i need to put here name and then inside this column we will have age inside this column we will have country so in this way guys you will basically uh, just have some records out there so in the tabular structure so you can do like this so we have this excel document here like this so we can fill out entries in these like this and we can even insert input uh, form fields as well guys so basically if you see inside this we have the line spacing option and uh, we can even make uh, some like this so let's suppose if i write something here uh, i write here uh, google i make this as let me increase the font size to of this guys so what i can say so if I, if you just press this button guys it will make the size of the document larger so now what we can do we can center this heading and now you can insert a hyperlink guys so now if i just say this text should redirect to google.com so i can say https google.com and then we can simply write here this is just google and now if you click uh, sure so now guys what will happen here it has translated into if you see basically it has translated into a link here so now this is the redirectable link guys so now if i click on this button i will be redirected to google.com you will see that and we also have an option if you want to basically embed source code guys so let's suppose after this you want at any point of time you want to embed source code you can even embed dates as well guys you will see date picker is also there you can embed any sort of date here like this click on sure and then if you want to basically guys embed some source code here so let's suppose i write here let name is equal to 5 syntax highlighting will also be there guys so whatever language code that you are writing here so i am just writing some javascript code right here so if you click sure so now guys you will see it has added this code here and it is having multiple pages route right here at the bottom side you will see that it will also show you the total number of pages that you're working upon so it contains three pages word count is also showing it is 476 pages you can even embed into full screen mode guys now this is full screen you will see that you can even zoom in, in inside the document guys you will see that how beautiful this uh, fully fleshed uh, pdf editor is you will see you can zoom in zoom out anything you can do this so i have coded this inside javascript all the source code guys you can purchase the full source code of this pdf clone editor i have given the full source code uh, with my full dedication i have written that source code so you can get all the javascript code and you can deploy this editor in the browser you just need to purchase it the link is given in the description of the video so you can just see guys you can zoom in here you can even zoom out and let's suppose if you want to paper type you can even change the paper type this is a4 size if you want to change this to a2 you can even change this so now this is a2 size if you see now this is a2 size you can also zoom out here so totally depends upon whichever paper type you like this is a3 and this is a5 So various paper types are also there guys 
so this totally depends upon you which paper type you like this is legal uh, paper stationery all that stuff is also there paper orientation this is portrait mode guys you can even change to landscape as well so this is basically it is given here you can even change to horizontal so all these modifications you can perform guys in this fully fleshed editor and you can as I already told you you can add images like this and the nice thing about that guys if you want to add a watermark there is also a watermark option is also there so this is basically this option if you click it these two options will appear if you want to add a watermark then as you press this button right here a window will appear if you click it let me just refresh this application so as you just click this uh, thing guys add watermark let me just write this the text here you can even add watermarks as well you can try it in your own thing you can even embed like this add watermark various fonts phone types are also supported guys you will see chinese fonts all these fonts are also supported and uh, you can also clear out the formatting and the nice thing is that guys whenever you are done right here you can also print this pdf document if you see you can print it out or you can save this as a pdf document either you can print it or you can save it as pdf now if you click save it will be saved inside my downloads directory whichever editor you can say click on yes so now this is saved here so now if i open this my guys this is a pdf document it is saved here so now you can see it is saved here now it is opening right here so you can even download the pdf documents as well guys so this is very easy uh, all the source code you can purchase it guys the link is given in the description of the video and uh, it's a fully fledged VisiVic PDF editor and you can ch also change uh, let's suppose if you want to highlight some text here you can just with the help of the mouse you can just select the text and then you can change the color here let's suppose I want to highlight with the blue color so now this text will be highlighted with blue color same guys if you want to change the text color not the background color you can change this option let's suppose i want to change the text color to red color so now this text color will become red color so you can you can edit the existing pdf documents guys just load it inside this and you can edit these pdf documents or you can create your own new documents like this this is a really good thing out there and the nice thing is that if you want to embed some form elements guys let's suppose check boxes you can even embed those also let's suppose here right here we need to embed a check box so there is an option here which lets you do that i think this option dividing line this is you can also divide you can add these dividing lines here various dividing lines are also supported this is hyperlink this is picture this is excel file i think uh, you can even add page break as well guys so now this is a page break any moment of time you can add this page break this is a watermark guys as i already showed you you can even embed content here like this any sort of content you can say type you can select here click on show so this is all about guys if you want to you can see that uh, checkbox you can embed this let's suppose if I want to embed checkbox here so what I will do is that I will simply say checkbox so you can just uh, download uh, after purchasing guys you can check out this tool by yourself the link is given in the description of the video thank you very much for watching this and one more thing guys you can even uh, i think you can uh, one feature i forgot to tell you there is also a feature which allows you to sign the pdf document yeah you can right click you can cut cut paste you can perform here and there is a print option as well you can print it as well right right here also 
and sign option is also there you can just sign your PDF document digitally signing the document like this and now this will place your signature here whatever signature that you do here you can download the signature as an image also like this transparent you can zoom in zoom out anything you can do you can place the signature anywhere so this is basically the way guys how we can uh, uh, do this so the full source code is given you can purchase it if you want to please support me i have dedicated all this to building this thank you very much for watching this